Hello everyone, I just want to show you how to install GNS3 latest version which is uh, uh, 1.3 and I'm using a Windows 8.1 uh, Really I could not install for ages, I can say for about almost a month and nothing worked for me and I've done like so many things that I watched from the YouTube or from, uh, from I Google it so I want to share with you a method that worked for me uh, and I haven't had any problems since I installed so uh, let me share with you let me open the GNS3 I think you know everyone of you knows like how to install or get a GNS3 so this is the GNS3 uh, 1.3 and uh, okay so let me go ahead and, and show you how to install we go edit we go preference we go chemo option and then we go uh, new and then we go down until we see like a uh, ASA by the way what we are installing is a ASA or adaptive security appliance from Cisco 8.4 uh, 8, 8.4.2 uh, so that's what we are installing and we just name it we just uh, we just selected that one and then we say uh, uh, next and then in here we have to give uh, identifier name or like a name just apart from uh, I mean whatever you can give it for me I will give it uh, ASA-1 and then I will just select it next and then it will ask I mean uh, it, it, it shows me the chemo binary or RAM so chemo binary you have to leave it this this one the one it, it shows and my one it shows it chemo 0 0.1301 because we've got like uh, quite few in here like three different one but the one by default it chooses the one it chooses by default to leave it with that and the memory it chooses it just a uh, 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 one one gig or okay, 1024 megabyte and then I I don't change anything in here and then uh, say next and then it asks me uh, the two files that we needed and uh, the two files that we needed uh, you google it and then you say like IS, uh, uh, ASA uh, security uh, I mean ISA uh, files if you say that then you can get it from google easily and then I've got these two and uh, one is this one ASA 8.4.2 I N I T R D. That is that's what it is. So you don't have to extract. We just open, and then you use another one. Uh, the kernel file. Look, uh, the kernel file. The the kernel image. You use another one, which is uh, that one. Uh, 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 v M L I N U Z. I mean the last uh, several letters. That is what I'm reading. And then you open that one. And then we we'll close it uh, or finish it. Now we edit, and then we don't need to change anything in the hard uh, 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 hard disk drive or whatever it says uh, HDD. Or we don't change anything in here. Uh, what we'll go, we go advance. And when we go advance, uh, then we don't change anything in here. We just disable the uh, uh, CPU throttling. We just disable it and we leave it. We don't have to touch a priority, a process priority. We don't have to touch it. We only change uh, this one. We only change uh, additional settings. And then what I will do, uh, I have a, a certain guidelines that I will, I think, attach you in my description below. So, and I will just uh, copy this bit. And then what I will do, I will just uh, I will uh, I will uh, I will paste. That's it. That's it. We don't need to change anything else. You got me. So I confused this one for almost a month, and now it is working me like a champ. So apply, okay. And then what I will do, I will show you. I will show before you. I just get two two ASA, and then I just uh, I'll just connect it to each other, and then what I will do, 
what I will do I'll just um, turn it on and then you see how it works it's like a jump it's two SA at the same time and it's not giving me at all any problems right now so I would really like um, like you to use this method and I'm using a Windows 8.1 64 uh, uh, version and so far I have not had any problems but before for a month almost a month I was having a trouble for this thing so I hope it will help you and uh, let me just uh, add, uh, configure like one interfaces and then make sure that it's working but I'll tell you one thing I can guarantee it is not crashing it's not doing anything before it was hanging you know one of the two ASA the reason I uh, I I I turn it I turn it on the two SA because I wanted to make sure that every SA works if I put like 10 they have to work but the, before these two they they couldn't work together just one of them had to crash or like freeze and that's what I like it really to 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 show you it takes a little bit but hopefully it's gonna go quite well now and um, we just wait it. We just wait it. And by the way, while we are waiting, I want to show you where you can get the activation key. The activation key go to um, I put it in my bookmark. You go with uh, the, the forum they call like uh, go uh, blast.google.com. Go to that forum and uh, activation key. Uh, here or you can check any anywhere you can I think I will put this one into my description video as well so you can get the activation key you can copy from there so uh, let us check if it is if it, now now we give time it's just coming so the main thing is like the activation key you get if you google it the main thing is like how to run smoothly and not give you not give you any more headache. That is our main priority, and that is what I'm sharing with this video with you guys. And yeah, you see. But by the way, I'm using a very 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 fast computer. Yeah, I'm using um, interface Geek Zero. Uh, no shot name if outside let me just because uh, they use outside isn't it? I mean the two is so for example we can say like one is re representing one one line and the other one is representing another line so they have to go through the cloud so name is outside uh, IP address let me give 192.168.1.1 and by the way if you want you don't have to I mean the 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 three major classes uh, ASA doesn't need to give uh, it doesn't need to put in uh, the uh, I mean the net mask or subnet mask if I can say now if I want I can say enter like that and then it will know it or if I want it you can choose like 255.255.255.0 that's just a bonus yeah and the other one let me go to the other one interface gig zero no shot and uh, okay name if and outside IP address IP address 192.168.1.1 uh, one, the two, two five five, dot two five five, dot two five five, dot zero. Uh, okay. If I say like, okay, ping, one nine two, uh, sorry, one nine two dot one six eight, dot one dot one, and uh, then look, then it is pinging because this one, if I say like, show interface IB brief. In the routers, we say like show IB interface brief, but this one, 
uh, the ASA we say like show interface IB you know IB comes uh, IB goes uh, up to up here and instead of going between uh, like show IB interface brief yeah so now you see the interface of uh, uh, of this router it is um, it is two yeah and then it is pinging each uh, his neighbor so it's not crashing the main thing is not crashing that, that that's what I really li like to share with you and uh, say your opinion and then we'll start from there thank you guys I hope this is this has been informative for you and I would like to thank you for viewing.